This is a kind of a, a conference um, called With For About. This is the third iteration of this conference. So this title of this one is called Making a Meal of It. Um, we've done these kind of annually now for the last three years. And really they're a kind of a, a gathering um, for workers within this field of practice to, to convene, to communicate, to surface some of the issues, some of the tensions, some of the possibilities in this field of practice. Um, and for us to kind of um, debate and spend time with each other. We really kind of played with format this year, in, I suppose in response to some of the more structured kind of conference moments which feel very presentation heavy, very kind of hierarchical. What we wanted to do was to create something that felt very active. Um, so what we've got now are kind of six different groups moving through St Helens, all working and embarking on a kind of shared mission, um, but also taking those things in different directions. So I'm really excited to see what, what emerges over the next two days. So Patrick was really keen to have a kind of unconference. So um, to think about how we might embody the values that we're also describing rather than just talking about them, do them, and to have a collective action from the people that were there at that conference that they could then reflect on as a group rather than just bring their own experience. Uh, the idea was that people would collectively make a meal together and that was the point that I was invited in to think about how you would practically do that. And. As I talk now, the groups have just been sent off and they are having their first conversations of what they would like to produce as a course for this dinner this evening. The first hour of the day tomorrow will be those groups will stay in those groups and people will reflect on their experience a bit. They're also forming a publication. The idea is that, they, that throughout this day and a half they form a publication that will then also be published and distributed before they leave. <laughs> we are the Orange Group and we've decided to make soup today. We've got individual vessels locally sourced from St Helens to cater each conference member. And we've got variations of spoons from actual spoons to pak choy and ladles. So it's going to be really interesting to see how people receive it. At first we looked around the venue so we noticed the food bank so a lot of part of the money we've decided to dedicate to the food bank so we've allocated like a certain amount of that and then we were talking about what food was made up um, here so kind of soup came up quite a few times so we went that way. We're here in the Quaker building and uh, we started the day by walking through the town together. We all had these bits of elastic and we were using that to try and make connections with each other. I think we were struck by being in this building and this being the oldest building in St. Helens in such a beautiful space and actually that seemed to offer a really nice provocation and I think probably partly because of that we decided that we wanted to source food locally so we have been talking to pie manufacturers and uh, we're right next to a local brewer and right now it seems to be just me here because everybody else is running around buying things and uh, collecting the things that we need for this evening. We are making bread. Like we ended up somehow, like we, we're somehow, what's happening here is an accidental or maybe not accidental, ritual, Christian ritual, you know. It was quite interesting because I think we started our round sort of quite, people felt quite stressed. There was quite a sense of like needing to produce something and then we kind of um, questioned that. Um, and we were like, huh. So um, it's interesting how we kind of reproduce certain ideas of getting something done. So we went to the kitchen and then we found serendipity this great board game that is um, that is obviously based on the the soap, you know, in, in Liverpool, and um, and I think that we took it as a sign. Um, I'm here with a group of eleven others, and we're working on um, making a meal for other people who are engaged in the same place, thing as us. Um, we're at the minute putting together some cookie cakes. The reasons will all be explained soon, I'm sure. 
Um, but yeah, you'll have to come back later to see the Great. result. to reflect on things a little. I mean, I've enjoyed it um, socially, and I think it's some big questions are beginning to percolate. I think today will be helpful in terms of being able to articulate through writing what happened, why it happened, why we made the decisions we did, what was default, what was challenging. So it's early, it's a bit early for me to be able to say. I was a bit nervous coming to St. Helens, I didn't know anybody. By the end of it, I had done 10,000 steps on my phone. I had discovered nearly every street in St. Helens and I think it's just an absolutely fabulous place and the people are lovely. And uh, yeah, I loved, I loved just the whole um, discovering a new place and, and that we're all the same at the end of the day. All the artists are striving for the same thing, engagement.